As the country wakes up from a year-long hibernation, the demand for travel is climbing. There is a lot of pent-up demand, so travelers should expect the roads to be busier than ever, the airports to be busier than ever. The average week-long vacation for a family of four is ringing up at $4,500. AAA predicts 37 million people will kick off the summer travel season over Memorial Day weekend. That's a lot more than traveled last year, but it's still lower than in pre-pandemic years. This is not the year to wait for those last minute deals. This is the year where you want to plan and you want to book now as far in advance as possible. Um, not only because there's high demand and rising prices with airfares and hotels and rental cars. The points guy, Brian Kelly, says rental cars are no longer an afterthought for travel. Car rental apocalypse, as we're calling it, uh, shows no signs of abating, especially as we get into summer travel. Now, they can be more than the cost of your flight per day rental. Adventure seekers and nature lovers need to read the fine print. Because so many places are still requiring reservations, from theme parks to campgrounds. So you want to make sure that you are able to do what you want to do when you arrive in your destination, and reservations are going to be key for that. Whether you hike the mountains, lie on the beach, or head to grandma's house, experts ask you to remember that we're still in a pandemic, so don't abandon all common sense. Dan Shenneman, NBC News.